Hey guys, it's Mama J. And Wingles the Elf. And Wingles the Elf. We are here again with day two of our Vlogmas. So, now it's 23 days till Christmas. It's getting closer. Santa's coming. Have you been good or have you been bad? Hmm. Not sure. What about you? Well, I'm an elf. I'm always good. <laughs> Are you the elf that wanted to be a dentist? No. Okay, just thought I'd check. All right, so, as you guys know, we are doing a Vlogmas every day. This is day two for us. So, we each have um, our advent calendars that we're going to open. We also have a mini mystery that we're going to pull out. See what we get, because it's in the big bag of mini mysteries. Also, um... For today, we're going to talk about Toys for Tots. So as you guys know, every year, um, Toys for Tots does a drive for all the children whose families really can't afford toys. And they gather all the toys together. You do have to go in and apply to receive toys from Toys for Tots um, if you're a family of low income and stuff. So, it, I mean, they have it set up really well every year. Um, myself and my mother uh, buy toys all year long. I'm not, I mean, we buy them on clearance. We, you know, if we see good toys on clearance, we'll buy four or five of them. And then we store them till the end of the year. And then we fill up the truck and we go to the local fire department and drop them off. You know, that way kids get toys. When he was little, it was every toy he got, they got. Now he's an adult. So we just buy toys throughout the year, and then we take them and we drop them off for donations. But for every sock I get, they get a toy. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. But this year, um, Funko Pops and Unicorns, which is Caitlin, is doing a giveaway for anybody who donates to Toys for Tots, which is a wonderful idea. The way it's set up is if you want to donate toys, you can donate. You can donate as many as you like. Please do not think that the limit is the 10 that we're talking about. You want to donate 20, 30, 40, please do so. But if you donate 1 to 10 toys, depending on how many you donate, you can have 1 to 10 entries in her giveaway. That's pretty awesome. Not only that, but if you would prefer to donate money, I will link the website down below. You go to that website, you make the donation, one to ten dollars gets you one to ten entries. She is capping the entries off at ten. So you can't have more than ten entries. No. Uh -huh. Yeah, no. But you can donate twenty, thirty, forty dollars. Please feel free. The more we donate, the more kids will get a toy. And that is the most important part. Not only that, but let's be real. How many Funko Pops are you guys all sitting on? that don't fit in your collection, you don't want to spend the time selling them or whatever, you know, they'll take the Funko Pops. They're still in a box. They're a great toy. You know, there's kids of all ages. So, you know, donate your phone, take 10 Funko Pops and go donate them. Take a photo of yourself donating them. Send the photo to Caitlin over at Funko Pops and Unicorns, who will also be listed down below. And you can have 10 entries in her giveaway. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to link the video down below that she's updated last because she is continuously updating it. I also have the link on my Instagram inside my link tree of her video. It will tell you all the giveaways. We're donating a $25 gift card. And I know that she did three customs of some Pokemon Pops. She also did a single custom. So that's two giveaways. Uh, Sassy Cajun has done a mug. Um, Sonic Never Wins, I believe is the name. Donated a gift card. I think Cherie is donating. There are so many people donating. She has a whole list. Go watch her video. See everybody who's donating. There were tons of pops donated by LBD and Andrew. So please, please go check that out. Help a child out. That is the most important part. So, but on to something else. What'd you get in your advent calendar? Let's find out. 
and then we'll find out what I got in mine. Don't forget, watch for the code word today. So, yesterday, we got big headed Goku that doesn't want to stand he up. He doesn't want to stand up. Oh. Today. Uh oh. We got a green bag. Oh, yeah, yesterday was a black bag, huh? Red bag. Oh, red bag, oh. Maybe they're alternating on Christmas. And oh, look, the numbers are green and red, so maybe that's what it is. We got Gohan when he was training for when uh, Vegeta and Nappa were coming with Piccolo because he has his sword and everything. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. So, he's got a big head, too. <laughs> he goes the other way. Um, okay, so as you guys know, I'm doing the Pixar one. Yesterday, I got Sully. I'm not taking him out again because he was a struggle. And today, number two is right here. Oh, go figure. I got Mike. Say his last name. Wazowski. Wazowski. I always say Lebowski. <laughs> um, that's cute. That's very cute. So, Sully and Mike from Monsters, Inc. Those are my first two. So we'll have to see which ones I get going forward. But again, every day I will be pulling one. I will say this, that some of these might go into a giveaway of these ones. Those we will keep because he collects anime. These ones I'm opening for fun. So again, make sure you're watching because some of these could be part of the giveaway. All right, and now let's uh, pull up our Christmas sack there, and I get to pick the mystery mini today. It's a big old Christmas sack. And today I got a bag. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's um, My Hero. Oh, this is the Hello oh, Kitty the ones. Oh, that's the Hello Kitty ones. Um, these are pins, and this is a blind box. So we will get one of the My Hero pins with the Hello Kitty character. Which one will we get? Which one would you like? So which one would you like, Wingles? Uh, probably Sue. This one right here with the frog? Yes. Okay, so this is pretty cool. So I'm going to open it up and see which pin we got. And we got... Who is that? That is Bakugo. And the penguin, I'm guessing. No idea who that is. So Bakugo and the penguin from Hello Kitty. So that is the one we got today. Probably won't stand because it's too heavy, but that's pretty cool. Yeah. It's a pretty nice pin. These are pretty nice pins. They come with the great clasp on the back. And the pin itself. Very nice. So I like that. Oop. The pin cap thing is so small. Okay. So that's pretty cool. Awesome, awesome. All right. So anything else today, Mr. Wingles? Mm, not today. No? What kind of toys did you build at the North Pole? Oh, I'm on vacation. Oh, he's on vacation. <laughs> is Spectre there building toys? Yeah. I feel sorry for those kids. All right, guys. Make sure you check us out tomorrow. Bye.